Paul Gregg even teaches a course here at UCF to help students with their financial needs. It's called personal finance. Student Tamia Caldwell is in the course and explains why she believes it is beneficial. The surgical internship offers eight different specialties for students to shadow. They range from vascular surgery, foot and ankle, and neurological. However, it is recommended that if a student only wants to shadow one, they find their own doctor. Here in Howard Phillips Hall, students can come in and seek advising on the Think 30 scholarship from freshmen and sophomore advisors. The UCF College of Business and agents from the insurance company State Farm created a workshop for students called What Every College Kid Needs to Know About Money. Reporter Princess Lowry shows us how the workshop showcased personal financial management. UCF students entered the workshop by gathering inside the university's Pegasus Ballroom in hopes of gaining financial health. The workshop started with the assistant chair of finances, Paul Gregg, discussing why all students should know how to budget and do proper financial planning. He explains why financial literacy is something that all college students should be knowledgeable about. As a college student, you now are at the point in your life where money issues such as your credit rating and student debt become issues for students as they go through the process and ultimately get a job. Paul Gregg even teaches a course here at UCF to help students with their financial needs. It's called personal finance. Student Tamia Caldwell is in the course and explains why she believes it is beneficial. This class essentially teaches you all the skills that you need to know in order to get that mortgage, to get the car loan, to pay off your student debt, to credit cards and interest rates. Greg continued the workshop talking about student loan debt and how to build a credit score. He notes that 56% of UCF students are in debt and says there is one rule everyone should know. Uh, the number one rule is if you can learn to, how to save at a young age, you will have plenty of money later in life. Greg says to save money, students should stay out of debt, protect their credit rate, and learn how to save. The workshop ended with an array of tables for students to approach to get other financial questions answered. Reporting in Orlando, Princess Jeanne Steverson Lowry, UCF Nightly News. UCF says the one common mistake that students make is borrowing more money than they should, preferably no more than half of their starting salary. The university also says they'll have more workshops on what students need to know about money. For more information, students can visit College of Business or contact them via phone at 407-823-2158. Students planning on attending UCF and the College of Medicine have a chance to take what they've learned in school and apply it in the real world. UCF is offering a surgical internship for pre-med students where they have the opportunity to shadow surgeons for an entire semester. Students in the College of Medicine learn many things ranging from prescription pills to saving the lives of others. They get this experience by shadowing doctors in hopes of one day becoming one themselves. However, UCF is doing something completely different. UCF officials are offering hands-on educational workshops at Florida Hospital Orlando. Assistant Director of the Surgical Internship Program and intern Maria Panilla shares how the internship has helped her. It's really seeing the behind the scenes um, life of a surgeon and a physician, just in general, all of the background work they have to do and um, the way that they interact with patients. Panilla says UCF is the only university in the state of Florida to offer a program like this. To make the application process easier, Panilla shared the information about the internship on her Facebook page, titling a post, Hey UCF Friends. In the post, there is a link that students may click that will take them to the online application. The application closes December 1st at 5 p.m. Another assistant director and intern, Angie L. said, says what students can expect during the internship. They'll provide the procedure to us and we'll be able to see it and witness it. And then afterwards, we'll do a write-up of the procedure as well as a treatment and then we'll discuss it. Having good grades and time management skills is key to making the internship successful. Panilla gives off what she believes is the biggest tip of all. Uh, you must have morning availability because that's when surgeons operate and you need to be able to stay for um, multiple surgeries throughout the week. The internship offers eight different surgical specialties ranging from neurological to plastic surgery. Reporting in Orlando, Princess Jeanne Steverson Lowry, UCF Nightly News. If you can't make this deadline, it's okay. The internship is available to students every fall and spring semester. For more information, students can call the College of Medicine at 407-226-1000.
In the summer of 2015, UCF implemented a new campaign created to help students graduate on time and minimize college expenses. The campaign is called Think 30 and is a scholarship that focuses on bringing awareness to academic advising, making responsible financial decisions, and preparing for the future. The Association of College Employers says students who graduate on time can earn nearly $49,000 in their first year of work. Office manager of SSYC believes that Think 30 is a great option. I believe the Think 30 campaign is very beneficial for students for the fact that it will allow them to complete their degree program within a very timely manner, so within the standard four years. Here in Howard Phillips Hall, students can come in and seek advising on the Think 30 scholarship from freshmen and sophomore advisors. By applying for Think 30, students will be able to earn two $1,000 scholarships. This is a way of rewarding students who take 30 credit hours and earn a GPA of 2.75 or higher. Chairman of Think 30, Jenna Nobly, says it will take a few years for us to see an overall impact, but we are hopeful more awareness will increase the four-year graduation rate. On UCF campus, Princess Jeanne Steverson-Lowry, UCF Nightly News.